Hello, this quick video will show you how to record an audio recording with online voice recorder and save it to your computer. So it's a pretty simple process. We're just going to online-voice-recorder.com um, or you can find the link to that in my um, course on this, this particular topic. So all you have to do um, when you get here, it's like I said, it's just very simple. It will ask you to um, allow your microphone, which of course you need to give it permission to do. You can always check that if you're in Chrome anyway, which I always recommend. You can always come up here to this little um, icon, click it, and it'll tell you if the microphone has been allowed or not. So if somehow you click the wrong thing um, when that pops up or you just miss it somehow, um, you can always go there and then click allow. Okay, so our microphone's allowed. Um, it's making me reload the page because I clicked something. Um, okay, so now I'm going to click this little record button, and as soon as I do, you can see that it's recording my voice on the screen, and you can see how much time you've taken. You can stop it, you can pause it, and then restart it if you'd like. So I'm going to go ahead and stop it. There's my audio recording. Um, you can see that you can do some trimming. So if you um, stuttered a little bit as you get started, which I do all the time in my videos, um, or, um, or maybe it takes you a minute to get it stopped and there's some dead space at the end or whatever, you can pull these in and adjust that. You can also play it um, to hear it and make sure you're happy with it. If you're not happy with it, you can just click the X and you say yes and then you can start over. So I want to get a recording again so I can show you what to do um, if you want to save it. Go ahead and stop that. Okay, so all you have to do is click this little save button. It's going to tell you it's processing for a minute, but you may have noticed that it came down here to my downloads bar um, and it's an mp3 file, which is what we want for audio most of the time. Um, so it's right there. It's in my downloads bar at the bottom of Chrome. It would also be in your downloads folder um, so that you can then put it wherever you're going to put it. So that's it for this video. The next video in this course will um, show you how to put that audio recording in Google Drive, adjust the share settings so that then you can include it in an e-learning lesson or post it on Google Classroom or whatever purpose you're using it for. So let me know if you have any questions.